Good afternoon, everyone. Good afternoon. We are here once again. We have to travel to another galaxy. But before we do that, I will, we'll go ahead and do some certain things here, like uh, talk about Tuesday. Tuesday, well, I'm still not sure exactly what we're going to do. We'll probably do some Fall Guys to start, and then we'll probably do some um, something else along there. I, I'm still trying to figure out what to do on Tuesdays. The problem is I don't want to... I want to find something that would work, but I don't want to keep doing the same thing. Every single thing. Um... We did Knights of the Old Republic last week, so we're not going to do it this time. I'm not really going to push Star Wars The Old Republic. Uh, Final Fantasy not, uh, 14 not going to be done. Um, so I'm still trying to figure out Tuesday. It's a little shaky. Then on Thursday, of course, we will continue with the Inquisition. We had a lot of fun last week. If you weren't here, well, the Inquisition will find you. They have more than just a small set of skills anyway um and then next sunday of course will be mass effect andromeda uh thursday and next sunday of course will be at 6 p.m eastern just like normal so tonight we have mass effect andromeda here we go and we go ahead and get that started for y'all but how are you all doing here today? It is a good day, I do hope. This is an interesting... Yeah. Let's see what happens. Let's see here. Connecting. And online. We shall continue. A bit of bad news I had a my laptop of about six or seven years now is pretty much uh, dead don't know what is causing it um, thought it was one thing it turns out it's not it's not that I have a $13 possible solution for it but you not going to uh, I doubt that that's going to be the true solution but we'll see what happens it will be a full deconstruction project um, in order to fix this, but it's not. It's one that is easily done. I've done it before. I just haven't taken it that far apart. All right. So first thing we have to do is check our lovely strike teams. What? what can I do for you, Pathfinder? Uh, I'll let you go. You probably have work to do. We can chat later. You know where to find me. Uh, gotta love delays. There we go. That's what I wanted. Alright. Golf uh, got was successful. Victor went up in level. Nice. Very good. They were successful as well. Excellent, everyone. Excellent. Juliet, nice. 
Good. Good, 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 good. Alright. Okay, what's this one? Yeah, we'll send him on this one. Higher chance to uh, succeed. We'll send the strike team on this one. We'll send the strike team on this one as well. Send Juliet. All right. Got all the strike teams up. Let's check AVP. Let's collect all the boards. No, uh, no cryopod points. We do have to visit Eladin. Kadara. I guess we're going to. Let's see what else is on Kadara for us. Okay. Forgotten history, Krogan betrayal, night on the town, gone with the wind. All right, let's go. Let's go ahead and pull Kadar into the hundred percent mark. So, where do we need to go? We'll do that one. All right. It appears festivities are underway. Mr. Adal asked you to meet him at the entrance. Right. 
Hold up. This is a private event. Name's Ryder. Human Pathfinder? I'm kind of a big deal. There's no Ryder on the list. He's with me. Reyes Vidal. Go on in. Uh huh. Reyes Vidal. I was beginning to think you wouldn't show. Remember what I said about fashionably late? Shh. Introduce me to your companion. Pathfinder? Meet Kima Dorgan. The Angaran representative to Sloan and. Uh, a friend. Reyes has friends? Nice to meet you. A pleasure, Kima. Call me Ryder. Reyes mentioned your professionalism. Sorry to cut this short, but I need to take care of something. Abandoning me already? It won't take long. There are important players here tonight. You should mingle, make a good impression. Oh, but I came here for you. Okay, fine, I'll start without, without you. You're gonna be playing catch-up on all the fun. I work best one step behind. Promise. And there he goes. Any idea what he's up to? It's better not to worry about what Reyes does. Enjoy the party. <laughs> okay. First official day as an outcast. Supposed to meet with Kaidas in an hour. Zetha says he's a major hard ass, but he was nice enough during my recruitment. For Turian, anyway. I'll just make sure not to be late. Update. Never mind. They were right. Major hard ass. End log. Look suspicious at all. Fine, we'll talk to Sloan. Nice bar you installed. Oh, it's Umi. I see that Kytus needs to vet the guest list more thoroughly. Oh, don't get testy. Relax, Your Majesty. A friend invited me. I'm only here for the drinks. You can freeload like everyone else, but don't cause trouble. Pathfinder's honor. Just go. <laughs> I love how it tells you exactly who to talk to. One wrong move and you're out. It's all tight. Have a beer, Kytus. It'll be good for your health. I don't drink on the job. So clock out. Live a little. Just keep a low profile. Sloan's already gonna give me hell. So good to see you again, Pathfinder. My people aren't all bad. Thanks. Seen Reyes? Are you resistance? How do you know Reyes? How did you meet Reyes? The only way anyone meets Reyes Vidal, through business. His skills are very valuable in Kadara Port. What's it mean to be an Angaran representative to Sloan? Sloan relies on me to provide an Angaran perspective. Does she listen to you? Only in extreme cases. She makes a show of being pro-Angaran, but her priority is the outcasts. She throws these parties to mollify my people. It won't work forever. Are you resistance? Are you part of the resistance? No. Ephra and I share information, but Kadara's problems come first. If war breaks out between the Collective and the Outcasts, it will be my people who suffer. I think I'm all bad. I hope these pirates haven't given you a bad view of my people. <laughs> Don't worry, Ryder. I judge individuals, not groups. You, for example, I like. 
Not sure about who you work for, but I've learned to keep my options open. Okay. It's good to be flexible. You never know who might end up in charge. Exactly. Has he seen Reyes? Have you seen Reyes? No, but I'm sure he'll be back soon. Right. Nice talking to you, Kima. Likewise, Pathfinder. Okay, so now I get to go find Reyes, this. where are you? No answer, but I believe he headed to one of the side rooms when we arrived, Pathfinder. Let's see what he's up to. Damn it. Why can't the serial numbers be in the same spot? Known. Take the night off. <laughs> Come out for a drink. Should have known you were up to something. Ryder. It's not what it looks like. So you didn't use me as a distraction to go through Sloane's stuff? <laughs> okay, yes. But it's for both our benefit. I You've promise. You've been making a lot of promises. Shit, someone's coming. We need a distraction. Fine. Sorry. <coughs> My friend had a bit too much to drink. <sighs> Hey, it worked. <sighs> Next time, I come up with the plan. <laughs> Finally, here it is. <clears throat> That's what this was all about? Whiskey? Uh -huh. The only bottle of Mount Milgram in Andromeda. Triple distilled and 645 years old. This isn't whiskey. It's treasure. Uh-huh. Sharing is caring. I hope you're planning on sharing. Ha. <laughs> we'll see. Let's get out of here. Okay. Gorgeous, isn't it? I sometimes forget. Is Andromeda everything you hoped it would be? Yeah, this has its perks. Every day is an adventure. Even my nights off are interesting. What about you? Why did you come here, Reyes? To be someone. Someone. You're someone to me? To new adventures. That's not the answer I was expecting. And new friends. Okay, so journal. Helios, Kadara. Gone with the wind, find the stolen turban parts. Settling Kadara, ask outcast leadership about trouble on Kadara. Let's do that one. Morpheus! I kind of wanted to kiss him after the toast. Yeah, this character's not going after uh, Reyes. This character's going after Korra.
Right, have a moment, Magic. Pathfinder. What's You've up? handled your fair share of cat. <laughs> Hard to get far in Andromeda without running into them. Yes, and? When Sloan took over, she slaughtered the cat who were here. There were mass executions, public. So people would know that Kadara was cat free. Hey, Fluff. But there have been rumors of stragglers in the Badlands. If the tales are true, they need to go. Mm, heard any cat room? Uh, any cat related rumors? What exactly are the rumors about the cat? Ambushes, people disappearing, vehicles sabotaged, picked clean for parts. Could be feral local wildlife, sinkholes, and gara bullshit. But there's enough people saying cat. How were the cat kill here killed? You said Sloan killed the cat here. What happened? The cat had the port locked down when we arrived. They were shipping Angara off for who knows what. People were scared. Good. But the place had potential. So we fought the cat for it. And we won. You saw the decorations outside. That's Sloan making sure everyone knows she's the new power. And why not send your own people? If they are cat out there, send your own crew to deal with them. Listen, this is how it is. Everyone knows Sloan destroyed the cat presence here. Anything that hints otherwise? Weakness. But you, you're independent. Where you go, what you do. Nothing to do with Sloan. Well, oh, fine, I'll consider I'll that. think about checking out the Badlands. Excellent. All right. Help Kytus with the cat on Kadar. Okay, so that's what I needed to do. Alright, so let's go find this. See here, take the, the lift to the slums. I shall keep my loadout. Yep, so. What have you been up to other than dinner there, Floof? Still need to take care of Kytus' cat stragglers. What do you think we're doing out here, Ryder? We're about to do that. Uh, we're going to change up the Nomad. Load out. We're going black out today. Got the blackout nomad. Oh yeah. Okay. Look for signs of cat on Katara. All right, so let's go to this guy.
Remnant from the Ashes with a friend, also playing a small, I don't know what to call it, other than a weird mystery text game. Interesting. The game is loud. Interesting. Shouldn't be. All right, turned it down a bit. Junk pile, gotta be scrappers in there. Okay. To the left. We're gonna run out of shuttles in this race. Check for survivors. All right, this is not good. What's Who? going on? Who's there? Hamash, is that you? Don't talk. We'll get you back to town. My voice is low? Oh, okay. I can't move. It, it's too late. I just want to rest. It's bad. I don't think the many will help. Can you tell me what happened? It, it was the cat. Took us by surprise. They killed everyone. John lasted the longest. They didn't know I was still alive. I saw them raiding our packs. Then they... They took off into the hills. Okay. Yeah, my... I was uh, leaning back away from the mic, so... That's probably why. Okay, so... The hills. What's in the hills? Is there a cat base there? There's nothing in the hills. I don't... We've never heard of a base. Sloan says Kadara is free of Ket. <laughs> Doesn't mean that... What did the Ket take from you? I... Uh, I don't know. Supplies. Weapons. Scavenge ship parts. Alright, rest now. I'll leave you to rest. Thank you. I... I wish... Kite is its rider. Your cat rumors have weight. Just found a caravan they attacked. Damn it. Grace thought we got them all. One of the wounded said they headed for the hills. I'm gonna check it out. I'll search too. Grabbing a shuttle now. Yeah. Scan for cat tracks. Yeah. That's not what I wanted to do. So where the hell are these tracks supposed to be? Oh, I see something I'm going to go pick up. Hey, it's lithium! Yep, Rip, the unnamed traitor who died after giving us all the information he had. Funny how that happens. At least he was able to give you the information before he died. Okay, that's 98 meters.
There we go. There we go. Cat tracks. They're leading up into those hills. All right. So let's go. Cat tracks. We're going the right way. Ah, there we go. Tracks. There we go. More tracks. Can't be far now. That's a uh, educated guess, I guess. See that cave? Good spot for a hideout. Bet the cat are inside. Kytus, I think I found something. Sending the nav point. Let's see what's going on. Impatient, are we? Sloan, I wasn't expecting you. She wouldn't take no for an answer. I'm not about to let someone else fight my battles. Especially an initiative lapdog. <laughs> I'm a lapdog? You were happy enough to have this lapdog track down information for you. That's what dogs do. Fetch. Enough. Let's get this over with. You're such a grump when you're worried. Every second you're gone from the port is an opportunity for the Collective. The Pathfinder and I can have... What was that? They know we're here. Get ready. Uh-huh. Exactly how you're supposed to do it. Watch your back. <laughs> Got you. Wait for trouble to come calling. Time to go find out what the cat had. There's a container. All right, here we go. Down the path.
almost down this way. Oh, some lithium. And there's another container there. Go talk to Titus. Nope. Okay. So it was quick. So she wasn't away from the port all that long. Wait a minute. There's lithium. Oh, iridium there. But do we really care if she was away from the port then? Uh, personally me, no. I don't. I just did. Okay. What's this? Investigate Spender's Kadara connection. That's oh, that's over here. this scanner anomaly oh okay so um let's see here we'll go back this way head out this way Collecting junk, these outlaws won't have a faction. Keep your guard up. data pad nearby pathfinder there it is you should encrypt your information a little better we got a hold of a juicy little bit juicy bit of info from your emails but charlatan would like to see what you've been up to oh. Oh. excuse me we'll conveniently misplace this data if you make the right offer what's our silence worth to you bring the goods to the nav point attached your outcast friends. Didn't we just read another data pad like this, but the other way around? This time, the outcasts are blackmailing the collective. The nav point has also been removed from this data pad. What is going on?
This is the location from the Spenderbit Pathfinder. Anti-vehicular mines ahead. It's best to proceed on foot. Outlaws. Maybe friends of Spender. Oh, this is gonna be fun. Gotta love it when you have to, you're forced uh -oh. to run in. We got company! That's not company! That's the Pathfinder! Spender must have blabbed. Let's get out of here! Quick, get on the shuttle! Hurry up! What the? No, 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 wait! Don't leave us! The bastard left us! Of course he did! All right. Shuttle left without them. What the hell do we do now? I guess we can wait. Let's examine the data pad. To William Spender from Undisclosed Recipient. Spender, we received your supplies, but I'm not sure how you expect us to keep pressure on the Krogan. It's half of what, what you promised. Maybe we can throw rations at them? I'm starting to think trusting you was a bad idea. Have you even used that scrambler I gave you? I bet it's just lying in your quarters or something. You've got a title. That means power. Use it. Aroni. No honor among outlaws. Nope. Not at all. So Spender's been sneaking goods from the Nexus to these exiles. Why? This Aron seems concerned about something hidden in Spender's apartment on the Nexus. Aron, I've tangled with that crook before. What's he doing with Spender? The datapad mentions a scrambler, which would explain the state of the file in the security archives. I highly recommend finding it. So, find the scrambler, nail spender. Check. Okay. Okay. Anything else we missed? Yeah, there's a container. Walk up the stair. Never mind. What's up here? Big container. 
Okay, we'll take that. Small container. We'll take this. Terminal. Shipment 349. Receive. Spender around. Medical supply crates. Okay. This must be a rendezvous point for these exiles. Remote enough. Great spot for Spender to do some dirty work. Well out of Tan's jurisdiction. Yep. Let's see here. Munitions. Data scramblers. Okay. Alrighty then. Alright, so let's take a look at our map. Firefighters. Find the stolen turbo turbine parts. Hitting rocks for science. Alright, we're going to go there. In order to get there, we will do this. We'll go to that one. Hey, Tiffany. What's up? So I'm facing that way, so I need to go that way off to the right. Yep. You're replaying. Nice. How far are you? over there. Want to stock up on supplies? Dead for a while, judging by the smell. I don't see signs of an attack. Uh -huh. Scanning the bodies could provide a clue. All right. <laughs> well, I'm sure you could uh, figure out a way. I mean, what have you done? Container. Data pad. Food and water in exchange for credits, salvage, whatever you have. Items at the top cost more than those at the bottom. Filtered water. Adi meat. Kirk and shell soup. Targ flank steak. Draw bits. Adi meat. Semi-fresh. 
Oh, that's fresh. Okay. Quite the menu. Hmm. Oh, there's another data pad right there. Hmm, that's encrypted. Sam, can you get us in? Yes. One moment, please. This log belonged to Skylar Yafir, an Angara who lived here. Oh? Well, let's look at the first log. Play the first log, Sam. More and more aliens keep showing up. They are desperate, dirty things who will pay anything for a slab of arty and clean water. I thought all was lost when the Kirk invaded, but maybe our luck's changing. Okay. Second log? Let's hear the second log. Today, I caught one of the aliens studying our filtration system. I had Karina and her sisters guard the facility. If these exiles learn how to make their own water filters, they won't need us anymore. Okay. Final log, Sam. Some of the aliens have set up shelter not far from here. They call it Caribdis Point. A band of them came today demanding we hand over our water filters. Karina and the others were able to drive them off. But I fear the desperate look in their eyes. Okay. That's enough. So, that's a problem. Lack of stomach and ulceration, consistent with poisoning by sulfuric acid. Most likely from consuming Kadara's water without proper filtration. The Angara have lived on Kadara longer than us. They'd know better than to drink unfiltered water. I suggest we examine the town's water supply. Yep, yeah, I'm still at that point. I just decided to get the planets to 100% before I get there. Okay. Someone has tampered with the filter. Oh. The Angara ingested only enough sulfuric acid to be lethal over time. But not enough that they'd notice right away. Skylar's log mentioned trouble with exiles. Let's check out this car of this point. Always a good thing to do. First of log. New entry, everything hurts. I've thrown up so much. I fear my stomach has flipped inside out. Even Skylar, the strongest of us, looks like death. End log. Okay. A filtration center. If they had this, why were they drinking poisoned water? I could provide an analysis via the scanner pathfinder. Okay. Yes, the Asari Ark was definitely a cool, cool mission. Baggins, thank you very much for that host. You do so very much for me. Thank you. I appreciate it. I hope that your work is treating you well tonight. And Tiffany, I've already, as I was about to say, I'd already started to um, uh, started saying that I'd already done the uh, fix the bulb on this planet. Okay, a spring that emits pressurized water and steam. And it is very true, if anyone here who does not know Frodo T. Baggins, you might want to go check him out. He has got some good stuff out there, and... And... I think he's pretty damn cool. Now... If you like what you see, give him a follow. If you don't, just be be um, nice and pleasant. Other than that, have at it. Yes, this is Kadar.
Okay. Data pad. New entries. Aliens arrive daily now, starving, filthy, and the way that they look at us. I begged Skylar to show them mercy and not charge them for food, but he wouldn't listen. I have a terrible feeling about this. Any resident of Qadar who wants their own piece of land is welcome to have it. The Badlands are free for the taking and I encourage settlement. Our best chance for survival is developing this planet's natural resources. Sloan Kelly. <laughs> yeah, I just got to that same point. So there's Charybdis Point. <sighs> Tomorrow night you're off. Uh, you're playing 14. Uh, you're going to stream. I'll, I'll be joining you. I don't stream on Mondays. <laughs> In this case, I actually punched him. It was like, quick, hide. Uh, quick, something's coming up. SOS, an emergency situation has arisen. Please trace this signal back to source. Immediate assistance is required. I have located the source of the SOS, marking the nav point on your map. All right. over to that one. Yeah, well, I've kind of been pushing for a different um, love interest anyway. Plus, I'm playing a male, uh, male writer. For anyway. Hmm. Another memory trigger? One of your father's memories is now accessible. Return to Samnode on the Hyperion to investigate further. An undocumented mineral has been detected, Pathfinder. Yep. There it is. Uh, yes, I'm going Cora. Now, Suvi is a uh, female only. Uh, Su uh, Suvi is for female writer only. that after the uh, SOS. You're playing a female writer? Yeah. There we go. 
Hey, Tiger, how you doing? <laughs> I might try Cora, but not sure I could go with Liam. I'm not leaning, uh, but I'm leaning towards Suvi or Cora. Uh, Cora is a male writer only uh, option. Good, I'm glad to hear it. How, what's up with you today? Okay, we got something here. Check it out. Someone got our SOS. No shit, it worked. Okay, under the influence of some unknown chemical substance affecting motor sensory functions and complex thought processes. Yep. Now, PB, on the other hand, is also is for both. Uh, is for both. Uh, Reyes is for both. Um. I think Vetra is for both. Gil is male, uh, is um, Scott Ryder's counterpart as well. Yep, Gil's there. Gil for the male, for the male uh, writer. All right, let's read the data pad. Dear diary, it's happening. The plant's kicking in. It's great to have your mind blown. What if my arm got hungry? What if it wanted to wanted a snack and ate my foot? Really? PB is pretty hot and she's super mysterious. Yep, yeah, and she can be kind of fun. Uh, found out Gail was male only the hard way. <laughs> if I was in in the game, everyone would want. No, Frodo. No, they wouldn't. Sorry to burst that bubble, but new. Dear, uh, let's see here. Would they switch places? There's also this problem with purple. What's the deal? If I can't, dis if it, it can't decide if it's blue, just make up its mind already. Another thing, space, time isn't what we all think. We're each individual pieces of energy drawn from a much larger pool given physical form in an artificial time stream. Time doesn't actually exist in the classic Newtonian sense. Everything happens at once, but our minds couldn't handle that, so we process it one moment after the next. But I see it all now. It's all happening. The Alpha and the Omega united. And shit, I think I just I think my toe just ate my hand. Alrighty then. data pad to anyone who likes drinking water word is there's some people out here who found a clean underground well it's up in the hills hard to find but Murdoch says the uh, the mean guy said the other guy with the scars saw one of these people trading for supplies. The guy living in the cave, four leaves. That nasty Asari chick with the scar, three leaves. Bubba Quaid, Bubba Quad Krogan, eight leaves. Sloan's bodyguard, two leaves. Get some munchies. Turian with the nasty with nasty burn uh, burns near Fire Lake. Crazy mental Solarian who talks too fast. Four leaves, six leaves. Don't know. Can't understand them. All right. We got your SOS. What's the emergency? Oh, uh, well, it's not like life or death or anything. It's just our plan over there is dying. What? Are you kidding me? We thought it was important, like someone dying. Hold on now. So yeah, maybe we oversold it, but it's important to us. It's how we make a living out here. Our plan? Uh, 
Well, has medicinal properties. <laughs> medicinal. Yeah, that sounds good. And we sell it to, you know, customers who need, uh, medicinal assistance. Yeah, but our heat lamp UV thing broke and it's gonna die. And you look like the clever type. Well, maybe you could find one? Yeah, not medicinal, my ass. Sure, this is all about medicine. Oh, it totally is. Antibiotic, whatchamacallit. And maybe it has you know, other benefits, but in the Badlands, can't be picky. I'll have to get back to you on that. Or not. The first thing you just said. We'll take that option. Remember, a UV lamp thing. Uh-huh. This plant yeah. appears to have unique pharmacological characteristics. It can act as a powerful antibiotic. Well. However, at much higher doses it may produce psychoactive effects. So they weren't completely lying about it. Alrighty then. Yeah, it is. <laughs> All right, so what else we got? There's something there. Let's see, it looks like when they, uh, yeah, they definitely did. Scans indicate this site may be worth searching for Angaran relics. All right. What's this? Remnant polymer, nitrate infuser. Okay. All right, so it's a container. Really weird looking container. There are stairs here. This may be an Angaran okay. musical instrument. Let's show it to Avela. Ah, oh, very true, very true. Something in the water. I 
that truck. Alright, so I need to hang him right up here. This way it is. Pathfinder, we are nearing Kara at this point. The Exile Camp mentioned in Yafir's logs. We should talk to Malix and search the area for clues. Uh, not at this point. We're here already. All right. Keep an eye out for anything that might be connected to the poison in Gara. Picked clean. Keep an eye on him. He's been complaining about you know what, and I don't know. I don't want you know who finding out. Remind remind him of the oath if he disregards. Well, one less mouth mouth to feed. Water filters. The make and design matches those found in the Angaran town. Stealing wasn't enough. So exiles stole the Angara's design and poisoned them for good measure. The evidence is pretty damning. Hey. What are you doing in here? Uh -huh. A better question is, where'd you get the design for these water filters? Leave it alone, before you can't. You murdered an entire town. I'm not leaving until I know why. We came to them. Starving, dying of thirst. But instead of helping us, those flapheads bled us dry. Credits, clothes, weapons. They took everything. Not everything. You survived. You set up here. The Angara are the only ones who know how to properly filter this planet's water. All we wanted was to be self-sufficient. I offered to right. pay for the designs. Have a great they work. Refused. So you poisoned them. And took all their business. Uh, yeah. I see how you are. Hmm. You're a monster. No. I'm a survivor. Kill them. You don't. Check one out. Bolstering all shields. Gara got some justice. No small victory, kid. Okay, we already got him. Okay. Terminal.
Okay, so we took care of that. What else we got left? Ah. All right, so we'll do hitting, hitting rocks for science first. Then we will go find the turbine parts. Okay. All right, here we go. Hang a quick left. Documented mineral nearby, Pathfinder. Working it. There it is. We're all clear. Okay. Got that. Now, the next thing. These guys. I do like that, though. I'm a survivor. He's the first one dead. Yeah, definitely is. Okay, well. There's also this. Survived the Pathfinder. You know, when you face, when you think about it, Shepard was a full on Special Forces trained person. Whoa, hello. Maybe the scavengers will be reasonable. Sure, kid. Alrighty then, that was a fun trip. Totally not anticipated. Let's try this again. Got them all. Can I help you? We're not taking in anyone new. Say what? 
Hi there. We're not looking to cause any trouble. Trouble is all there is on Kadara. We just want to be left alone and... Wait. I don't believe it. You look like a Pathfinder. Um... First one you've seen? I take it no other Pathfinders have strayed this far? I wish. Oh, it's good to see you. Just knowing the initiative's still out there and making it work, that means a lot. Looks like you've got a good thing going here. We're refugees hiding on a world of exiles. We got kicked out of the Nexus, swept away in the uprising. We weren't looking to take sides or anything. We just wanted to eat. <laughs> then we found this place. Closed, sheltered from the crazies in the Badlands. And the bedrock here fills the water. If you can spare the time, we could use your help. Speak to the others, and they'll fill you in. I'll unlock the doors. Well, hello! That's it. Okay, that was laughably funny. They weren't there, and then all of a sudden they were, and they were bouncing all over the place while I was in a conversation. Yeah, literally. Alright, let's talk to these guys. Refugee. Oh, hi there. Something wrong? It's just hard. Exiled from the Nexus. My mother's still back there. I never said goodbye. Have things gotten any better? Well, there's hope now. Better than it was. It'll take time, but life might actually get back to normal. Oh, that's good to hear. I just wish I could talk to my mom. I've been trying to reach her, but our equipment's broken. Not sure it would matter. The Nexus is so far away. Never know. I could take a look. Would you? That would mean the world. Okay. Scan broken equipment. Alright. Is Let's he okay? See. No. Running a fever. Something weird bit him and he's got an infection. Usually remedies don't work on the venom. Okay, so what would help? Anything we can do for him? Unless you can conjure up some sort of antibiotic out of thin air, I don't know. Okay, and this refugee. So it's true. Pathfinders do exist. I'd offer you something to eat, but I'm afraid our food supply is tight. Waiting for these to ripen. It's okay, we're fine. I'm surprised you managed to grow anything here. A unique quirk of the bedrock in this area filters the water. That and a supply of UV lights. When we were exiled from the Nexus, I grabbed a crate. Well, that was smart, actually. That was some quick thinking. Small details can save the day. I knew if we were going to be stranded in Helios, food would be hard to grow. <laughs> we're the lucky ones. I feel sorry for the poor souls in the Badlands. A pang of guilt whenever I eat. Why don't you take a few of these UV lights with you? Maybe others can grow food, too. Anything to help this miserable hellhole. All right. Got that. What's the state of that? All right. 
98.1% purity, 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 good, good, good. Note if downward trend, our aquifer will eventually turn toxic. Something needs to be done to stabilize the environmental conditions. We did that. This was a pain in the butt to get up to. Yes, there it is. The communications junction is out of alignment. With an adjustment, a signal could reach the nexus. Adjust. There. Let's go see if that did the trick. So, yeah. 100% Kadara. Nice. I'm not far behind that. I just haven't put a settlement down. That'll, that, that'll push me up. I just haven't gotten there. Feeling sick? Suffering from Badlands Blues? We've got an herb for it. It'll make you feel better, both, both body and mind. You know what, what I mean. If you don't, then this isn't for you. You should go away. But if you do, come looking. To be safe, we can't provide coordinates. To those who those who seek shall find. Okay. Alright, so we got that. Now let's go to Gone with the Wind. That is a kind of reasonable. Okay. Someone got to them first. And destroyed Ashland's missing parts. What the hell did this? give Ashlyn the bad news. Yeah. journal settling Kadara find wait uh wait for trouble to come calling mm. all right let's 
get back to the Tempest here. I'm pretty sure that's what it means by wait for trouble to come calling. Rider. Yes, Callo. The hell you did? You can't just undo ten hours of work. I had to. Your revamp risks power imbalance between decks. Something we solved back home. It's twice as efficient. Just because it doesn't match your sainted specs. And now it does. As you say, deal with it. Callo. I know, just please don't let this distract you. <laughs> uh huh. Bitcoin channels already, Pathfinder. Is there? Nope, nothing. There we go. Okay, the firefighters, gone with the wind, herbal entrepreneurs, we can finish all that later. Let's go to Aya, turn in that uh, one thing that we found. Forgotten history. Tasks, supply, outposts, supplies on Vold. Okay. So let's see what else we have. over here. Apparently not. Alright, so let's go this way. Nice long dash. Out of my way.
No, that isn't the right spot. Let's see here. I was correct. Alright. Let's go over here. That figure really writer. something. They've got amazing rem tech really research going on it. here. Something about it calls to me. Like a friend. Okay. I love seeing our Milky Way peeps mingling with the Angara. It's early in our interspecies relationship, but I hope we can build on the momentum. Yep. We're forging the Alliance. We have an amazing opportunity. And a great responsibility. Whoa. That's your inspiring voice. You really can't turn off diplomat mode once it's on, can you? <laughs> Just riding you, Ryder. Keep up the good work. Okay. Pathfinder. Okay, nope, nothing for you. I'll leave you to it. Okay. Oh, you're here. Pavoa, I'm glad they finally let you into the city. You deserve it. This is Aya's cultural museum and history archive. It's small, but you've already made it brighter. Uh, you should... About that helmet. You said the helmet was touched by the Scourge. What does that mean? I forget your people weren't around for that. When the Scourge appeared, it targeted remnant ships, broke down their technology. With the drive cores disabled... The ships crashed. But that may not be all. The Scourge leaves a mark on whatever it touches. If it touched this helmet, perhaps the pilot was the target. There may be remnant tech inside the helmet. Or in the pilot. Storms. I hadn't even thought of that. Okay. Just give me a tour. Uh, no. I'll get going. I'll come back when I have something. Stars guide your travels. But I have something. Return the musical instrument to Vela. Return the carved figure to Vela. So I should be here. Hello, Pathfinder. Any good news for me? Oh, I found another artifact. I picked up this figure earlier. It might be Angara. This, this is unfamiliar to me. It does resemble an Angara, but it looks so strange. It's clearly centuries old. Is it an artistic interpretation, or is this what we really look like? The implications. Pathfinder, you may have discovered our earliest artifact yet. Hope it helps my chances. And I tossed it in cargo. Maybe it's not in cargo. Could it be a relic from another culture? The technique and material matches other Angaran relics, and you found it in one of our worlds. But perhaps the depiction isn't an Angara. It could be a deity of some sort. Is this Angaran? I found it in one of your homeworlds. Sun above. It's an ancient Ravan. A musical instrument. It uses Angara's body energy to produce music. We have them now, but nothing is beautiful. The songs it played were probably lost long ago. How much culture have we forgotten? Art, music, stories, it's all gone. You'll make new history. You're already rebuilding. Look at Aya. We have a long way to go. In any case, relics like this help us. I'll, I'll come go. back when I have something. Stars guide your travels. several points in this that actually point that there are going that there's going to be something extra all right let's see here what's no It points to, um, oh, hey, solo technician. All right. 
It points to the fact that there's so, there was something else planned there. Which way am I going? I do want to go back that through that door. You work on the solar panels? Do you have an amplifier for solar energy? Nothing as big as these, but I have a smaller one on hand. Do you need it? And I'll take that. So I'll take it and you'll give me 727. Here, I found the solar amplifier for Volt. They'll be happy to see this. No more power outages. Thank you, Pathfinder. Okay. So I'm going to take a real quick um, stretch and break, so I'll be back. Ryder, could we chat?
Alrighty, I'm back. Let's see here. Alright, we're going to go to the Nexus again. Got a spender to confront. All right, here we go. Oh yeah, we also have Earn Your Badge to deal with. Safely home, thanks to you and your skills. I've learned a great deal. What have you learned? I enjoyed it. It was fun to really test myself out there. <laughs> Spoken like a soldier. Your performance was exemplary, Ryder. I can see clearly why your N7 would be the best of the best. If you tire of being a Pathfinder, I'd be honored to call you a Brother Heskal. Well, thank you very much. Well, here's the problem. I'm not in seven. I never was. Gotta love that. Okay. So. Alright, where are we going on this one? Let's go up this way. I talk to my family every day. Terra Angel, thank you very much for coming by and bringing your stream with that raid. I do so very much appreciate it. Welcome, Raiders. Have a seat in the lair. We are in the middle of some Mass Effect Andromeda shenanigans. And if those of you who do not know me, my name is Frecky42, variety streamer. So you'll see me stream Dragon Age Inquisition currently. Ninja Brian, thank you very much for that follow and welcome to the pack. And also, I do Knights of the Old Republic, Star Wars the Old Republic, some Final Fantasy XIV, some Fall Guys thrown in there, whole lots of things. So how you all doing? Welcome, welcome, welcome everyone that's in my channel already that does not know Terra Angel. She's a sweet, fun play, uh, streamer. She does a lot of horror games. She does some Dead by Daylight. She does a few, this, a little bit of this and that. Go check her out. If you like what you see, give her that follow. That way you'll know when she's on. So, how was your evening in Resident Evil? I'm assuming this is the original. Okay. Let's 
Sam, anyone nearby? Negative, Pathfinder. The vicinity is clear of all personnel. Okay. You're still sick, but I did a little run. There is a blank spot in your vicinity, Pathfinder. What do you mean? I cannot see part of the room, for lack of a better term. Okay. Tara, if you're still sick, are you doing better, though? Are you getting better? That's the catch. All right, let's take a look at this data pad. Oh, can I take that? Initiative fighter model. Wait, is that what I think it is? That model ship was declared missing from inventory six months ago. Hmm. Pathfinder, hmm? are you putting the box back? I'm taking it. Finders keepers. <laughs> Director Tan, I am writing to request an official review of Nakmore Kesh's sustainability suitability as Nexus superintendent. Now let's see here. You're better. Good. Glad to hear that. I have to go get dinner. Uh, understand. Understandable. Dinner is good. Trust me. Dinner is good. The Krogan indeed helped us suppress the mutiny uh, by those we now we now dub exiles. However, given the Krogan's conduct during the uprising and their decision to leave the Nexus after their requests for more authority were denied, it is not hard to see Kesha's current position as a conflict of interest. I understand it may be politically beneficial to keep a Krogan on staff for optics, if not diplomacy, but for one of them to hold the power of the superintendent, give the, given the bre their breath, brethren's negative opinion of us is, is frankly playing with fire. It is my opinion as experienced public servant that Kesh should be placed in a role where she can do less damage, perhaps in charge of archives. Sincerely, William Spender, Assistant Director of Colonial Affairs. Uh-huh. Pizza can be, yes. <clears throat> Data pad. Ah, uh, colony name, New Chuchanka. Location, Elodin. Estimated population, 700 plus. About 1,200 Krogan came to Andromeda. Key people, Nakmor Morda. Drigal Strux, Nakmor Drac. The colony is thriving by Krogan standards. They are storing water and have enough to be self-sufficient. They have, they uh, they have time for entertainment. This is there. There is a fighting pit, a distillery, even a greenhouse, where they appear to be growing plants in an attempt to sustain the colony long term. This is spearheaded by a botanist named Vorn. The Krogan built the colony into the side of a sinkhole. Some construction materials were apparently taken from the Nexus. Other materials were locally sourced. The compound is heavily guarded and it is difficult to get in unless you are Krogan. Gee, I wonder why. Cash, I'm not sure what we can do here. We've got the system stabilized for now, but we're going to need to reroute power soon. We could lose some stasis pods if we don't. Okay. Advice for aspiring community leader to Sal Taylor. Sal, I appreciate you taking the time to reach out to me. I'm always happy, happy to give advice to junior colonists interested in future politics. My advice is my father's. Just before I shipped off to Andromeda, he said, always help the little guy, but always help anyone with their boot on that little guy's ne neck. To get where I am, you have to please everyone. This will ensure you will get the right, um, you will always be right with somebody. Gotta love it. Air filters. Spender. 
Del Jasson told me you just uh, denied her request for properly functioning air filters. Do you realize how important it is to keep our staff healthy and working? I can't understand why you would tr you try to block this. It's getting to the point where I need to talk to Addison about your conduct. I'm sorry, but this is getting ridiculous. Ridiculous. Re air filters. Bill, come see me. We need to talk. Re paper trail. A for someone so paranoid. It's funny that you you title your email paper trail. And then sign it with your own name. Why not just evidence? Of course, I've held on to proof of our agreement. You're in exile, aren't you? I need some leverage when you, for when you finally decide to turn on me. No one's finding anything. I doubt anyone even cares to look. S. Uh-huh. Gee, I guess. Meeting notes for Director Tan. Engineering has requested resources we don't have yet again. In particular, repairs to non-essential systems. I'm having doubts in Kesh's ability to prioritize tasks appropriately. Uh-huh. Supplies ready for shipment. Okay. Rebreather components. Power cells. Dried food. Scanning the labels, many of these boxes were reported missing. Uh huh. Audio log. The data pad is password locked. Shall I run a decryption? Yes. Seems worth the risk. Do it. Accessing audio logs. Personal notes one. Play the first one. Tan is starting to get along with Vetra's replacement a little too well. Better do something about it. Personal notes, too. Play the second one. Remind Addison that the Krogan all left. Keep her unhappy. Uh-huh. And number three. Play the third one. Stay away from what's-his-face in charge of the first colony. If he thought I was messing with Addison, he could be serious trouble. Okay. Thanks, Sam. What do we have here? What's this? I cannot scan what you're holding, Pathfinder. It's somehow blocking me, as a scrambler might. Sounds like a job for a comms expert. Okay. Let's go. Let's go to a comms expert. I talk to my family every day. They can't believe half of what I tell them. All right. Let's go. Pathfinder, what can I do for you? Just play along. I'm about to ask something, and I need you to just smile and look casual. Smiling and looking casual. Check. I found this thing somewhere on station. I need to know what it does exactly. Sure, I could... Wait. This is a scrambler unit. These things are illegal. Where did you get this? Keeping it quiet for now. You'll find out when the time is right. Or when I hack this scrambler for you, eh? Can you prove who's been using it? Solid proof. You bet. You could hack through every security wall we have of this thing. There's a reason they're illegal? Sorry, smiling, casual. 
Let me know when you're done. Yes, sir. Pathfinder, you have new email. All right. Always wanted to do that, just never did it. Attention. Let's see here, what do we got? Turn to the Tempest. And now for the extraordinarily long, uninterruptible launch of the Tempest. Let's check my email. Ryder, could we chat? Um, sure. What's up? I hear you found a stasis locker from the Solarian Ark. Technically, someone else found it first. But yes. How wonderful! I know it's not the Ark itself, but any sign is better than nothing, surely. Please, if I can help the search at all, just ask. Or ask anyway. You're good company. Okay. I'll let you concentrate. You know where I'll be. Yep. Right where you deserve to be. Alright. Krogan Colony Heist. Writer from Drac. Kid, I need to talk to you about the Krogan Colony. Something's up. I'll be in the galley. Acknowledge. We need to talk. Writer from Sloan Kelly. Come to Kadara ASAP. Okay. Thanks for listening. Writer from Liam. Enough said. Costa. All right, Drac, what you got? You wanted to talk? Ryder, I need your help with something. All right, must be important. I got a feeling this is something big. Yeah, yeah, it is. One of our botanists' heart called up in a panic. A colony transport has been stolen. It's a transport. Can't you just replace it? It's not the transport. It's what's on it. Our seed vault. One of a kind. Without that vault, things get complicated. Krogan children need the nutrients in those plants to survive. Even one clutch of babies hatch before we get the stuff synthesized. The effects would be permanent. So, what do you need from me? Ouch. I'm gonna find those thieves and get the vault back. Be nice to have you along. Okay. How'd they get the transport? Aren't the transports protected by passcodes? And how do you steal anything from a Krogan? First thing Hark checked. Looks like some old authorization codes weren't erased. He was working in the transport and stepped out for two seconds. The thieves walked right in and flew off. Oh, lovely. We'll get it back. Of course I'm in. Whatever you need. I knew I could count on you. Hark's waiting for us at the colony on Elodin. He's tracking down the transport beacon. He'll have the location ready for us on arrival. Good. We'll find the transport track. Don't worry. I'll hold you to that, Ryder. Hey. Thanks. I owe you one. Mm, don't worry about it. I'm not worried. You're good for it. All right. All right, so let's take a look at something here. Find the origin of the signal in the Nailish system. Okay. Uh, 
Ah, my little fighter. Alright. Let's see, where do we have to go now? Well, let's see here. We're gonna go here. We're gonna go um, advance the um, Rokar issue. We gotta have that fun. Yes, we must have that fun. There'll be lots of shooting. And we are now in orbit around tomorrow. Disembark. Okay. Let's confirm the loadout. Entering atmosphere. LZ in sight. Any word on Juvint and the others? No. All traffic and communication mm -hmm. from the Forge have stopped. It's under Arxul's control now. Oh, Joy. Any advice on how to get inside? My shuttle can drop you nearby, but that's about all I can do. Ephra doesn't want to make enemies of the Rokar unless we have to. We'll keep you low profile. See what you got. Howdy, welcome back. Initiative spear point armor. Backup life support. Okay, nope, nothing there. I was looking to see if they had something. Board the shuttle. Shuttle's prepped and ready. Good luck. So how do I board this shuttle? Allies and relationship.
Oh, there's the shuttle pilot. Afka says you need a ride to the forge. You ready? Yep, let's go. Let's do this. Yeah. Jaw, you sure you want me here? Bringing an outsider. Enter the clearing. Move carefully. We don't want to alert the Rokar. <laughs> Let the bastards know we're coming. It'd be easier if we knew where to find your family. The Moshai brings all of her students to the forge. I know my way around. The Govatan, a... well... It's... deserted. The Govatan is usually filled with travelers. Afka said no traffic in or out. I don't like this. Where? Are the Ruka? Okay, well, let's take a look in here. Wherever the Angara went, they left a lot of supplies behind. Well stocked. The Ruka bring this in. I. Uh -huh. And the resistance provides support. If they kept. It destroyed the forge. It would be a terrible blow. All right, terminal. Audio log. Found something. Looks like a journal. Everyone's so enamored with Axel. You would think he was the most shy. I told Joker to make him leave, but she said that all Angara welcome at the forge, especially one trying to protect our culture. <laughs> Protection? Is that what he promised? Okay. Confirm Aya shipment. Alright, so stuff. Complaint, supplies. Either convince the Rokar to share their supplies and let me do my job to catalog all this, or tell them to get all get out of my storage room. The logs have never been such a mess. You'd think they'd be happy to have someone itemize their sh gut. But they won't let me near a single crate. You invited them here. Do something about this. Everyone's so enamored with Axel. <laughs> Come on. You'd think he was the most shy. I told Joker to make him leave. But she said that all Angara welcome at the forge. Especially one trying to protect our culture. shaping process our latest attempt to recreate the heat shaping process used to build the forge was unsuccessful we were able to heat the rock samples to their melting points but they simply turned to magma and became unmanageable unman once these samples the samples cooled the surfaces the surface was marred with ripples and lacked the sharp smooth edges we were striving towards Lekha obtained samples of flora from the forge with minimal difficulty. Droka was worried about uprooting specimens near some of the older pillars, but I was able to safely uh, to satisfy her concerns with some low-risk candidates on the site's forge. For now, we will focus on care, monitor, and water intake and determine the average life expectancy. That will give us a baseline of future experiments. Axel pulled us out of the lab today. Talk to us about the Milky Way menace. Shaver says he's a radical. 
But he's only saying what everyone's thinking. The makings of a new recruit. Aksul's very persuasive. My brothers and sister are proof of that. Okay. I know we discussed this in person, but Vester believes that with just a few resources from the re resistance, he can make the upgrades we desperately need. We can finally determine the exact date the forge is created. Aren't you tired of saying sometime before the scourge? We've been studying the site for years. We should uh, we sh we should have this ans this answer by now. Like I told you before, I'm not against the upgrades, but we're in the middle of a war. The resistance already goes up, goes out of their way to provide us with food I mean, and uh, ammunition, uh, ammunition and whatever materials they can find. I can't ask effort for more. You'll just have to make do with what we have. What about the Rokar then? Axul once, uh, was once a scientist in his own right. Maybe he'd help us. I'll reach out, no promises, and I and don't send another request about this until I've gotten back to you. Play audio log. One of the Roka left a slice of fresh Elmuk at my station. I tried to thank him, but he wouldn't say two words to me. I think they've been ordered not to become friendly with us. Lethul, my brother, loves Elmuk. <laughs> it's his favorite. Think he's the one who brought it to her? Mm, maybe. But the rest doesn't sound like him. Lathul is very talkative. All right. Do not be fooled by kindness. The you hear that? Aksum's voice. You said you got them all. I did. They must have. Alien, kill it. Oh, shit. Hope no one heard that. They shot first. We had to defend ourselves. For Maxwell, the. In Formax, all the Gov uh, Govatan have been thoroughly searched. All civilians are accounted for. Ah, oh, yeah, right. Accounted for? What does that mean? We do. Rounding them up. So much for going in quiet! Ha <laughs> ha! Quiet's overrated. Surrender's not an option with your Oka. Take them out! Come on! Don't give him an opening! Alright, where the hell are these guys? Hmm. 
Area clear. Okay. Any sign of your family? No. The Rokar know we're here. Maybe that will flush them out. How do we turn this shit off? Okay. Knowing our tool, we can't. Lots of little stuff there. Folks, give me a few moments. A couple minutes. I'm going to... I hate to go AFK 30 minutes after I just had one. But... I need to... Try and... Stretch the... My back is catching up on me and things like that. So, I'll be right back. I'll be back. All right, folks, thanks for bearing with me on this. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to definitely finish this section, but if my back doesn't start easing up a little bit, I'm going to have to go off. Um, if I end up doing that, I will pick up on Tuesday with Mass Effect as well, because um, normally Tuesday is a four-hour stream. We're almost three hours in. That would mean... Uh, three-hour portion that I didn't finish here. I can go ahead and push that to Tuesday. So let me go ahead and do this. Guess we interrupted dinner. What's this? He really hates us. The catch made us fear the unknown. 
Your arrival will bring change to the Angara. Aksul fears that change. True. This also part of the Govatan? Living quarters for the archaeologists. Okay. The, the Roka have obviously made themselves at home. Locked. Sam, any suggestions? I detect electrical wiring underground, Pathfinder. You can use the scanner to follow the wires. Alright, generator. There. Doors should be unlocked. Let's go ahead and do this. There's a bridge to the ruins beyond those doors. My family should be there. Go! I take it the road car didn't want us going that way. How are we going to get to them now? We'll have to jump down. Now what? Up the hill. We that got company! Sharpshooters! Keep your heads down. Axul must have sent reinforcements! Take them out! We can't let them reach the nest! They're shooting us like hijacks! No, I just Push shot them like hijacks! Three in a row, headshots. older than me. <laughs> 
Just wait till we get inside. Inside? There's a cave ahead. Up that ledge. Alright, collect. I'll we'll take that. Do these markings mean something? Some think it is an ancient version of Shilesh. Our tr It's pretty here, I'll give you that. Betapad. Starting today, only the most faithful will be allowed inside the forge. New recruits must be vetted by Axul. Yeah. Definitely not sounding like somebody people want to know. Except the bad kind of people. What was this place before the Scourge? Mm, everyone's got a theory. The Moshe believes it was a... Intruders have reached the nest! I count three. Wait! I know those voices. Lasu! Go for backup! Lasu! Wait! Stop! Uh-oh. It's Jal. Jal, is that you? <laughs> Alrighty then. Baraj, our mothers sent me. All of them. Did our mother send this human too? So you're Joel's sister. Joel, you didn't tell me your sister was such a badass. Your people are a joke. Tevint, please. Why'd they send you? Because we've lost enough to the cat. They're afraid to lose you to this insane cause. But, Joel... I want you to meet my friend, Scott. So you can see that Axul is wrong. Yeah. We make each other stronger. We want peace. Trust me. We have as much to give you as you have to give us. We all win. Who cares? The Angara don't want anything you have. We don't need you. Jal, our mothers want us to live truthfully. It's because I love my mother that I will die for this cause. is going to blow this place Let's up. Go. That's why he sent the researchers away. Stop He has bombs. Talking. Stolen from your people. Those bombs go off. It'll look like the initiative did it. We have to disarm them. Yeah, okay. You just shot your brother for no reason. Give me! No, 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 no. The bombs in the forge. I'm okay, Jal. I'll be fine. You gonna make it? I hate Axul. Don't let him win. You got it. Okay. I'm glad you're here. Time to play. Need to find those bombs. If Axul's willing to blow up the forge, there's nothing he won't do. Ryder. If he shows up. I know. Follow your lead. Alright, 
safe. Here's one. One down. Now the others. Watch your head. took a lot of concentration. Jal! Jal! I killed that thought! I killed him! I'm so sorry! He's not dead. You are lucky. I lost my mind, Jal. I want to go home. But the cause. I joined because of you. I shot our brother. Don't leave Let me. her go. I only want soldiers who are committed to our cause. Jackass. Not weaklings who stand by and watch the destruction of our people at the hands of aliens. <laughs> You're desperate. Blowing up your sacred birthplace seems pretty drastic. Your cause is falling apart. Like you. I speak for our people, and I say, you're done, you heathens. <laughs> Martyr me, please. I dare you. Yeah. I don't kill unarmed crazy people. They move onto our planets. They take our resources, make us weak. I've watched Ryder make planets habitable. Exactly. And they'll never let us forget He it. rescued your beloved Morsai. I know. Saved her life. Uh-huh. I know. Stop defending them. The Morsai trusts Ryder. Then stop. We've been fighting the wrong enemy. Maybe the enemy is this traitor. Easy. Jal? Don't! The Moshai trusts Ryder. You've become a danger to your own people. Walk away. Or I kill you and reveal the resistance for the traitors they are!
Oops. The alien is not the monster here. I love my people. Come on. Let's get you home. You okay? Yeah. Thanks. <clears throat> All right. Ah, so we deal with him. We dealt with him. I'm so sorry, Lafu. I never couldn't even kill me at short range. <laughs> They are here. Let's give them a minute. Thank you for trusting me. Killing Aksul would have made the Rokar stronger. He shot you. I'm glad he did. It exposed how far he'd fallen. Oh, joy. You had me worried. Glad you're okay. You're a badass. It was pretty reckless. He could still be a threat. I've got to admit, you were pretty badass. Hmm. Can't let you be the only show off. <laughs> You've been practicing. A little. We should get back. I want to say goodbye before my family heads home. Alrighty then. Loyalty earned. Ryder has earned loyal Charles loyalty. Charles rank six skills are now unlocked. All right, so And this is it. There it is. I'm losing concentration. All right, let's get up to the tempest. Fourteen points. Specialist level forty-two. Oh, I didn't realize I was at already level forty-two. Nice. Ryder, could we talk a moment? All right. What are we going to talk about this time? I don't believe it. Gills reconfigured our entire nav array. O'Connell risked a dozen spacewalks putting that in place. Damn it! Hello, don't. Take the helm. I've had enough of this. Oh, boy. You don't give a damn what my team and I went through to build this ship. No, I don't. I care about us surviving out here, and if that means redesigning... You don't have the right! All right, what's this about? All right, let's talk this out. What's going on? I'm doing my job, and he's undoing it because... Hell if I know! You weren't here. We had to get all kinds of new tech working in a single starship. Fifty-hour shifts, epiphanies, accidents. 
Humans can forget. Salarians can't. To me, it's all still happening. My team is here. Stripping down the Tempest like some broken radio risks everything they suffered to build. Their legacy. Are you sure that's fair? If he had the Tempest up on blocks, I might see it. Look, Callo, your people did a great job, but they're dead. And they couldn't have anticipated half the problems in Helios. Like the Scourge. If we don't adapt, we'll die too. Is that what you want their legacy to be? Gutting a complex ship out in space isn't adapting. It's irresponsible and disrespectful. No. The Tempest is ours now. She has to serve our mission first in whatever capacity we need. Gil, change whatever you have to. I wonder, in time, will strangers be treating your achievements so carelessly? Peace and quiet, finally. Thanks, Ryder. Okay, show's over. Back to it. All right, well, we'll actually save again. We'll overwrite that last save. That just happened. Okay. All right, folks, I do... I'm sorry about this, and I know it's happened a lot lately, but I don't know. With everything that's fine getting to me, I guess, my back is hurting st Stretching doesn't help it, so I'm going to go ahead and call it. I need to be able to sit back, relax, and hopefully it will calm down. What I'm going to do is Tuesday we'll start with a little bit of Fall Guys. We'll start and let people move in, and then we'll, we'll, do, um, we'll swap over to mass effect we'll finish out the night with mass effect uh that way so you get the six hours that we had scheduled for today on tuesday this is another reason why i have tuesdays being a fluctuating <laughs> night like it is it allows me to fix things like this so guys good night everybody i'm going to let the auto host take it you all have a great evening stay safe out there this week and um get something done if you can Thanks, thanks, Morph. I appreciate it. It's just I want to do more, but my body is telling me if I keep sitting up like I am right now, it's not going to. It's it detracts from my concentration, and I can see it. I can feel it. So also, I'm tired as hell. Um, so I'll probably be going to bed relatively early tonight again, like the last couple nights. So good night, everybody. Stay safe. I'll talk with you all later.